Hey guys, what's happening? Chef Zach, Dogfish Head Brewings and Eats. Coming at you again with what I am cooking tonight at home for dinner. Tonight we're gonna have a little bit of seared salmon, some jasmine rice, some roasted zucchini and squash. Just kind of show you all the mise en place. And one of the most important things ever, our beer for tonight. First step for today, I'll be drinking a little bit of Naughty Bits from a Wouldn't It Be Nice series. Step number one, make sure you have something to drink. Second step, for the rice, we're gonna get that cooking first just because that's gonna take the longest. Took a little bit of white onion, a little Vidalia sweet onion actually, diced it up, a little bit of shallot, and then some lemon and lime peel. I'm gonna save the lemon for later. I'm gonna cut that half and I'm gonna squeeze that over the fish once it's done cooking. So I measured out two cups of rice here. I'm just cooking for two people today. I'm um, just gonna rinse this under low water, rinse off any of the extra starch that's stuck to that rice. Give it a good little rinse, don't be scared. Next, I'm gonna sweat down the onions and shallot. I got a saute pan on here. A little bit of high, I'm gonna add some olive oil to it. Wait till it gets nice and hot. And I add all the onions in here and sweat them down. Now that the oil's hot, add the onions and shallots into there. Kinda wish I had a third hand while doing this. Technically, I would add garlic to this, but unfortunately, um, my stash of garlic has ran out. Trying to limit our trips to the store, so we're working with what we have today. While these are sweating, I'm gonna add a little bit, season with a little bit of salt. I'm also gonna add some pepper, but again, pretty hard to do it one-handed. You get the gist. As always, my sous chefs are here helping me out. They didn't drop anything. So now that our onion and shell, it's getting a little bit of color on it. I'm gonna add in some seasoning that I have. I'm gonna do a little kind of blackened jasmine rice. Just a little blackened seasoning there. And then I'm gonna take the two cups of rice that I measured out. I'm gonna sweat that as well with this. So I'm only gonna cook this rice for a couple seconds, nothing too long. I'm gonna transfer it right back to my rice cooker. So I added water into the rice already. So if you stick your finger into the water, the tip of your finger should touch the rice and the water should come right to there. That's how you know it's at the right level. From there, I'm gonna add my lemon and lime zest into it. I'm gonna give it a stir and I'm gonna toss it in my rice cooker. So while the rice is cooking, I'm gonna sit here and get the vegetables cut up, ready to roll. I'm preheating the oven to 385. I'm gonna cook them there. Now I have the zucchini and squash cut. I'm gonna season it with a little bit of olive oil and some salt and pepper again. So once it's all seasoned, I'm gonna to toss it all together so everything's evenly coated. I'm gonna hit it with the pepper again. And from there, we'll go right into the oven. Now that the oven's hot, I'll toss these veggies in the oven. My zucchini and squash are done. They took about 15 minutes or so. Um, I went, went ahead, put a saute pan on, started getting it hot with a little bit of oil in it. I also took my salmon, seasoned it with salt and pepper. Um, I'm gonna get ready and I'm gonna sear the salmon. The most important part about this is really letting the pan and the oil get hot before you add the fish to it. Should almost be at smoking temperature, that way the fish won't stick to the pan, but come up nice and easy. Now this I'll let the fish cook on the lay side down. So it's almost all the way cooked through. You kind of be able to see where it's going to be cooked and you'll see it kind of rise all the way to the top of the fish. Once it gets almost halfway, I'll flip it over and I'm going to hit it with a little bit of lemon juice. Once the fish has a nice good serum to it, I'm going to add a little bit of butter to it. And the, lemon, and the other lemon. So I just took the fish off the heat. I'm gonna kind of let it set and finish cooking all the way through. Come back over, my rice is done. We're almost ready to eat. So a quick little plate up, put the rice on the bottom, some veggies, nice piece of salmon on it. And I'm gonna take some of this sauce from the pan, kind of drizzle that right over the top. Thank you guys for tuning in and watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys are making some of this at home. Um, we'll see you next time. Take care, be safe. We'll see you at the pub soon.